we're back. I'm out of that dungeon. Hopefully we have enough raw materials to work with here to make our ten iron savers for an obviously friendly gentleman. After all, only he would recognize our truly immense skill. Let's see, we got some tinders. Some canteens. Some coffee mugs. Some faucets. Ooh. That gives us more than enough raw material. Ooh, and we picked up an item to equip along the way. I still don't know what Jilty does, but I think we will equip it. We can equip a single support item. We can't use that in combat, but it can help increase our attributes. Let's see, we definitely got enough for the iron savers at this point. Too bad we can't choose to make like 20 of them. We can also make a Mystic Ore version. I, yeah, I'll make one. Just to show you guys what it is. Now, I always like elemental weaponry. Right? An Aqua Saber. It looks a lot better. It'll probably be the weapon we use for the next tournament battle because it'll be probably the most powerful thing we got. I wish I could skip this, honestly, but I can. And since I have to suffer through it, so do you. So I'm not editing anything out. If you don't like that, get out. Let's see, we're up to seven. We'll need one more win thing, it looks like. We'll be one short due to the um, Aqua Saber. <coughs> Sorry about that. But I think I know what we can do to make more. We can melt down our crappy Novin's knife. Then we have just enough to complete the final saber. There we have created ten iron savers. Equipment. We'll put the. Uh... Actually, I think the aqua saber will. Replace the chav sword completely as our first item, but it will be. We'll keep it in reserve just in case we need it. Let's try not hitting the save point, and let's overwrite the data. I don't want to not overwrite it. Silly game. To the port, so we can make five thousand bones. Because we are destitute. But yeah, I don't think there's any side quest today. Yes.
There we go. We should find out about tournament matches. Because our M -nays. Yeah? Who's this guy? Oh, it's the prick from the intro. The That guy was mean. Hopefully we can beat him up. Because of his meanness. I'm not sure where I have to go. I think I have to talk to someone in here, but I forget who specifically. Yes, we're already familiar. If I use a different type of weapon from what I'm already using it, I'll just explain it. It's easier that way. There's someone in one of these rooms I have to talk with. Oh, sure, I just wasted several minutes of our time. Maybe we have to go back to. Ooh, who are we fighting? Kenon from the Gold Guild. We'll save first. As always, we can only use a single weapon in these battles. So I'll have to unequip two of them before we proceed. Okay. What the hell? Excellent. Standard RPG logic applies here. No matter how long we take, we'll always be in time for our tournament matches. Which is good. Looks like the tournament match will be in the next part, however, but let's go get our swords back. Our incredibly, obviously, crappy swords. For the bad guy. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we can overwhelm this prick. <laughs> he uses lances. Yeesh, I hope he blocks. I really want that weapon. To be honest, I could just block and he will break his weapon on me, That, but that would make for a boring video. Keep blocking. The more he blocks, the more likely I will shatter his weapon. And if I get down low enough, I'll just block uh, to death. Drill weapons are best for breaking weaponry, I found. There we go. Now I can make his spear. I don't really like spear weapons that much, but I will make it if I have the materials. But yeah, we wrecked his stuff. wasn't even his own spear. No wonder. Now she's a lot nicer. That's good news. Let's hurry to the... Tur no wonder there's no side quest today. I, I think... So not. Yeah, I think a few things changed because I beat the crap out of that guy, but I don't think there's any specific side quests available. So, yeah, this looks like a good spot to stop. Next time, the tournament battle. Good night.